With the beginning of summer, the car begins to complain, and the breakdowns increase. Perhaps one of the most common things that cars complain about and have problems with is the fuel pump. Today we are talking about what some people call the mistake of boiling gasoline. We will mention the most important indicators that can tell you that the fuel pump has become tired and needs to change how to check the fuel. Pump determines whether it is good or not, every thousand kilometers I have to change it, and is it possible to change the fuel pump from the second car if the valves are the same? Frankly, I did not find a clear date for me when the fuel pump started, but it is certain that it started with the start of cars. The fuel pump simply works to transfer fuel from the fuel tank to the combustion chamber, whether the carburetor system or gasoline or diesel sprays, and the fuel pump can be mechanical, which started its spread with carburetor cars and operates through a mechanical arm that moves it or an electric fuel pump. The electric fuel pump was at its inception installed outside the fuel tank, so it was mostly under the car. It was large because it was exposed to accidents, smuggling and bumps, and with the development of technologies, it became installed inside the fuel tank, so it is safer. Also, the presence of gasoline inside the tank on cooling, but even its presence inside the fuel tank is always summer. It gets high and gets the bad and the weak out of it, and unfortunately it breaks down at the worst of times. The fuel pressure is a very important matter and differs from one car to another. In regular spray systems, the fuel pump prepares a constant pressure between 45 to 55 psi, more or less, and transfers it through mechanisms and pipes from the gasoline tank to the engine, specifically to the sprayers, from there to the combustion chamber. In direct injection or GDI systems, we have two fuel pumps, an electric one in the fuel tank that pressurizes and delivers the fuel to the second mechanical pump at the end of the engine, which raises the pressure to more than 3,000 psi, and from which the fuel is delivered to the sprays and from the sprays to the combustion chamber. You see what was wrong with the carburetor number from 6 to 10 psi, the regular injectors ranged from 45 to 55 psi, and the direct injection reached more than 3,000 psi. In some V-shaped cars and engines, you may find two pressure pumps, each unit at both ends of a line of sprays. The best way to check the fuel pump is with a mechanical watch. Here, do not forget to wear safety glasses so you install a pressure watch before the sprays, either through a clear entrance or you disassemble and install it. In some connections, when you open the switch, the pressure must remain constant, it does not come down permanently, and it is according to the maintenance booklet. If it goes down very quickly or within half a hours, it is close to zero. This is evidence of pressure leakage inside the system, either from the sprays or from the fuel pump itself as well. And from the fuel regulator in the pump, as well as trampling and while walking, the pressure must be constant and not drop at all, and in general, if you have one of the following things, you probably have a weak fuel pump other than it before it breaks down. If you are going up hills and the car becomes weak or turns off with you, and when you unscrew the fuel cap, gas air comes out of it, and either it cools down a little, it starts again first. In the vent solenoid, the pressure does not remain until it equalizes with the outside air during the ascent of the mountain and causes gasoline to escape in the manner that people are talking about. If you start to hear a buzzing from the fuel tank in the morning, hot night, or cold, then this is a strong indication that the pump has begun to deposit. If your car engine is running late and you have to knock 5 to 10 seconds until the car starts, then this is not normal. Check the pump pressure as we explained, some modern cars can put a device on it that gives you a code or you can read from it the pump pressure and it can show you what of the two pumps, there is a problem with the front, which is the high pressure, or the rear, which is in the tank. If the torque of the car has become noticeably weak, or you notice backfire, squeaking, crackling, or the sound specifically, especially with trampling, 
This is one of the indicators that the fuel pump is weak. Always check the fuel pump at the same time. The problem is not sometimes. It works well and the pump pressure is intact. If the fuel pump fuse hits, be sure to check the plug of the pump sometimes because of the heavy electrical load and because of the weakness of the fuel pump, the plug is ruined and drained. And now with some common questions, does the fuel pump have a maintenance schedule or a specific time for replacement? No, it does not have a maintenance schedule and most of the fuel pumps run about 300,000 or 400,000 kilometers without any problems. Can I install the fuel pump in the car again if the shape is the same and the plug is the same? The emergency can do anything. As for the correct one, you must install the same number required by the manufacturer, and the reason is two things. It is important that you understand the pressure and volume, meaning how much the pump gives pressure and can move and transport fuel in a specific time. As you know, the computer gives an order to the sprayers to open and close based on pressure in time. For these reasons, it is very important that you install the same specifications programmed on the car. Does it harm Abu or affect me if I leave the tank to empty completely before filling it? I personally do not see any problem with that, and this may be a point of contention with many. I will make a full episode on this matter. Do cleaning materials for sprayers or the quality of gasoline 91 or 95 harm the fuel pump, the type of gasoline at all? No, and detergents in general, no, unless you are talking about unknown materials. The important thing is, please do not put thinners, diesel, or magic mixtures in the tank and expect that it is everything. Mm -hmm.